Buying a new TV should be a thrilling experience, and it often is. But there is one rather daunting obstacle to overcome. Just there are so many models, types and sizes to choose from that it can be almost impossible to work out, which is best for you. Fear not though, as we are here to help. Before you succumb to crippling indecision, allow us to take you by the hand and lead you along the path to TV Utopia. We've run the rule over all the major 4K and 8K televisions we've tested to bring you the cream of the crop. If a TV is on this list, it's a bona fide belter, so you know you're getting top bang for your buck. For more information on the products, I've included links in the description box down below, which are updated for the best prices, like the video, comment, and don't forget to subscribe. Now, let's get started. Number 5. TCL 6 Series QLED with Mini LDAD R635 When we discovered that the new TCL 6 Series 2020 QLED R635 would use Mini LED back at CES, we were shocked. That's because, just last year, that same technology came to the high-end 8 series and cost hundreds of dollars more than the ultra-affordable 6 series. It's not the end-all, be-all LED LCD we were dreaming it would be due to its limited brightness and poor motion handling, but it truly is an exceptional value and one that we'd recommend to nearly everyone. The 6 series is brighter than before, more colorful, and doesn't have a single hint of hollowing or light bleed. It's designed in a new way to hide your cables and it's the first TV to come with thanks certified game mode for 1440 pixels by 120 hertz gaming. It's not exactly the TV we'd recommend to next-gen ready gamers looking for a perfect companion for the Xbox Series X or PS5 that can push 4K at 120 frames per second. But if you're buying a TV to binge Netflix, stream Hulu or, well, basically just enjoy your viewing experience, this is the 4K UHD TV that we'd recommend for you. Number 4. Hisense UHE If you want a TV that offers excellent value, then a mid-range option like the Hisense UHT is the best TV that we've tested. It's a great TV with impressive picture quality in dark and bright rooms. It comes with the easy-to-use Android TV as its smart platform, and you can either watch apps directly on the TV or cast content from your phone. While it doesn't deliver the same perfect black levels and perfect black uniformity as the LG C1 OLED, it still displays deep blacks with a great local dimming feature and minimal blooming around bright objects. It supports both HDR10 Plus and Dolby Vision ATR formats, which is important if you tend to stream ATR content, and you can display the content properly on the TV no matter the format it's in. It also displays a wide range of colors in ATR and gets bright enough to make highlights pop and colors look vivid. Overall, it's a great fork TV that offers excellent value as a mid-range option. Number 3. Sony XR50 X90J The X90G's pictures aren't exactly shy and retiring, and that's fine by us. Exceptional amounts of brightness make it onto the screen with startling consistency, delivering some of the most flat-out punchy and bright HDR pictures we've ever seen on a 50-inch TV. It's not just brightness for brightness' sake, either. Sony is unashamedly using it to deliver as uncompromising an HDR experience as it can within its backlight limitations so daylight HDR scenes look more natural and realistically bright by far than they do on any other current TV in its size and class. Even more impressively, the XR50 X90J has enough headroom with its brightness to ensure that the brightest highlights of already bright HDR images enjoy that extra step up in intensity that usually only the most premium TVs provide. The price you pay for this superb brightness is slightly elevated black levels and occasional backlight blooming but neither issue is a huge deal-breaker, and you can also add excellent motion processing, natural colors, and decently dynamic sound to the list of the Sony's strong points. It's also got two HEMI 2.1 ports that support 4K at 120Hz, and sense a software update VR. Number 2. Samsung QN90A Neo QLED TV the Samsung QN90A Neo QLED DTV combines Samsung's highly refined quantum dot technology with the tight control of mini LED heat backlighting, resulting in one of the best TV displays you'll ever see. Brilliant color and unmatched brightness make for superb performance, and Samsung pairs that with a bounty of smart TV functions and genuinely intelligent features, like a solar-powered remote control that eliminates the need to swap out batteries delivering eco-friendly design and unbeaten convenience at the same time. The whole thing is packed into a gorgeous one-inch thick design that contains a huge array of smart features, 
putting Dolby Atmos to hound and some of the best performance we've ever seen. HEMI 2.1 connectivity comes standard, along with gamer-friendly features and impressive 12.6 millisecond lag time for an unparalleled gaming experience. Number 1. LG G2 OLED The LG G2 OLED is our new favorite 4K OLED TV, thanks to a raft of upgrades over last year's G1. In our testing, it reached 590.54 nits of brightness, for instance, which is impressive for an OLED TV, if not quite as high as the Sony A80J elsewhere in this list. And performance is excellent all round, with good color accuracy and reproduction, better than expected audio, and of course, the deep blacks we've come to expect from OLED. As one of LG's Gallery Series TVs, it's also quite the looker, with a near bezel-less design, while a full complement of ports adds to the package. In fact, you get four HDMI 2.1 sockets here, which, combined with the dedicated gaming mode and the low lag times we measured in our testing, makes it a great choice for gamers. The LG C2, which we're currently testing, may ultimately prove a better purchase for some people. But until then, this is the best OLED TV you can buy. So that wraps up our list of the best 4K TVs. Hope you found this video helpful, and if so, please leave a thumbs up as I always appreciate that. Also, please feel free to leave a comment, suggestions for future videos or questions you have, as we love getting to respond to as many of those as we can. And if you subscribe to the channel, welcome to our valid consumer family. We've got lots more videos coming your way into. Till then, stay safe, stay awesome, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.